Hi, Kumar Kosho here, and now we're going to be looking over the Power Strategy 1 setup and entry. So now we're first going to look over at the long setup. So by long, what we mean is when we're actually going to be buying in the market. So we're looking for an ABC formation, which is an up move. And what we mean by that is this diagram here. So what we've got is we've got, we want price formation to go up and then come back down, forming an A, B, C formation. Now what we need is for this retracement from B to C to be 50% or more of the A to B leg. Now what we mean by retracement is we've got price going up and then if price comes back down into this up move here, it is retracing into price. So that's all a retracement means. It means if price retraces, means comes back into previous price movement. So as we can see here, A to B goes up, and then B to C comes back in to previous price movement, which was the up move. So it's retraced back down. Now, what we need is for this move from B to C to be at least 50%. So 50% of what? 50% of the A to B leg. So we count the amount of points from A going up all the way to B. And we want 50% of that to be hit from B to C at least. So let's say the move from A to B was 100 pips. So the price at A to the price at B was a difference of 100 pips we would need the price to go down at least 50 pips, which is 50% of the A to B move, for us to validate this as a ABC formation. If this had only gone down from point B down 40 pips, that would not be what we would want and we would negate this as any potential trade for us. It needs to go down at least 50%. Now you've obviously already seen this in the previous videos where we explained the ABCD formation. So we know that we want it to be between 50% and 90% for us to validate this as a potential trading opportunity. Now with a long entry, we want to enter on the C to D leg when it has moved up 25% of the A to B leg. So here we have the A move up to the B, then B down to C. Now B to C is at least 50%, but less than 90% of the A to B move. We know that. So yes, this is a valid play. Now we're going to look at it and wait for a trading opportunity. We then start getting a move up. And what we want to do is we want to enter when the price going up has gone up 25% of the A to B leg. So let's say the A to B leg was 100 pips. We would want the price to rise 25 pips up from point C for us to be entering. And obviously we are entering for a long position here. Now the short setup. So now instead of looking for an ABC up move, we're going to be looking for an ABC formation which is a down move. So just the reverse, we've got A higher now, A to B coming down, B to C going up, and the B to C retracement has to be at least 50%, but obviously, as we know, less than 90% of the A to B move. So as we can see, price has come down, and price retraces into previous price movement. So with a short entry, we want to enter on the C to D leg, when it has moved down 25% of the A to B leg. So we've got the A move down to the B, B up to C, which is at least 50%, but not more than 90%. And then when price moves down from point C, 25% of the A to B move, which is represented by this green line here, then we want to enter. So if the move from A to B is 100 pips, we would want to enter 
when price moves down 25 pips lower than point C. 25 pips is 25% of the A to B move which we're saying is 100 pips in this example. Now obviously that 25% will obviously vary depending on what the move from A to B is. The ratio of 25% is obviously always going to be the same but what I mean here is that 25% however many pips that is depends on what the move from A to B is. So you work out the move from A to B, find out what 25% is, i.e. divided by 4, and that's how many pips we need it to move down from point C to enter. Here we're obviously entering for a short. So that's the entry that we're looking for. Now if you click over to the next page, we're going to discuss the other component of our trading strategy, which is the stop placement. This is Kumar Kaushal for Trade to Success University, and I'll see you in the next video.